What's good? This RJ. Let's get straight into it. YBC Dog, Mr. Disrespectful, Mr. Grave Digger himself has been shot and killed. I'm not even gonna hold y'all niggas. This is crazy. He really live up to his name, Mr. Disrespectful, bro. He been doing a lot of crazy ass shit and talking too crazy, bro. Like, dog really dug up his op's grave, bro, in the music video. That's too crazy. Got no f***ing tombstone. I'm gonna dig his f***ing dirt up. Hey, yo, where the f***ing Kwani at, yo? Kwani, where the f*** you at? Ah! It's no coming back from that, bro. Like, that's like top-tier disrespect, man. Like, I'll be ready to crash out for a nigga even speaking on my mama, bro. So imagine if a nigga go dig your man's grave up, bro. Nigga, you probably, man, I don't even know. I ain't even want to say what I would really do, bro. Like, cause that shit, whoo. This nigga dog loved dissing his ops more than he cared about life. If I'd love dissing my ops as much as this, man, I, I'd probably make a career out this shit too. And he was getting paid, bro. I can't really blame the nigga, bro. You can't knock the hustle and shit, bro, but. Shit, we see the outcome of that sh you feel me? Bro, he must have knew that he was going soon after he did that sh bro. Dog really manifested this sh Talk about, I ain't never been robbed. I ain't never been touched. I ain't never been shot ever. Oh, nobody don't play with me. I never got robbed. I never got touched, shot at in the city yet. Like manifest some positive sh Not no negative sh bro. Then you see what happens, bro. Go manifest a business. Manifest like some money, bro. Something positive, anything, bro. These young niggas be rapping, getting money and shit, and the first thing they spend their money on is chains and shit. My nigga, you in the war zone, bro. Move out that bitch. These niggas wanna stay in that motherfucker because it's fun, bro. Or they really be broke as fuck and can't move out, bro. I don't know which one it is, though. People really think I'd be in other states. The whole time, I'd really be here. What makes you wanna stay in Philadelphia? My niggas here. Like, I gotta chill with the guys. I can't bring everybody out, Kylie. Do you ever see yourself like moving out of Philadelphia for good or not really? Yeah, wow. Well, I ain't staying here. This is a dumb place to stay. <laughs> bro, just look at how this nigga looking at the camera, bro. You know this nigga lying, bro. He love this shit, bro. And why? And watch your Brandon, my nigga. He know this nigga fucking lying. He ain't trying to leave the hood. Dog, nah, this nigga dog funny as hell, bro. This nigga capping like a motherfucker, bro. Talk about, bro, I can't bring all my niggas to Cali. He ain't never been to Cali, nigga. I ain't staying here. This a dumbass place to stay. He love that shit, bro. He love that hood bro. I mean, bro. It's sad because, like, he was kind of tough at rapping, bro. I don't really listen to, like, Philly rappers like that, but bro was kind of tough. Go check him out. I'm gonna leave one of his songs in the description. But regardless of what he did and what he said, rest in peace that man. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you think about this whole situation in the comments. It's been your dog, RJ, and I'm gonna catch you in the next one. Peace.